Greetings. This is General of the Armies Vincent Diaz Jr. This is a communique for all stakeholders involved in living in the United States of America. Attention to Vladimir Putin and all world leaders. CC those who choose my way of life so I have espoused in this series. Communiques. Here we are again. With this last time I had to address this nation like this. I was trying to prevent the Capitol riot here. The Capitol riots. I had no success except clearing my name and helping those prepare who helped I prepare, who wanted to prepare the way we could not prepare except to help each other cope, make it through. You're up against a force of nature here. You who are now up against losing your right to bear arms, losing your right to personhood, losing your right to your um, sovereign health care, your abortive rights lost, the right to the right to control your body. There's more to it. Those are big, big, I'm here in the epicenter in this unbelievable situation like I am legend to what Will Smith was left with. I think you've already lost. We all basically think you've already lost. We're at this ultimatum. You don't have long. You have like two days to act. None of you have shown me any signs any capability whatsoever even proving you're still alive out there leaving us no options meaning I as God's messenger the intelligence here and my boss, my God boss my ranks, my highest ranks, like I am the highest rank, such as Vladimir Putin, only his maximum strike options of his maximum strike systems of these sequences and scenarios, sort of like in Terminator 3 and such, to control this swarming plague of these humans turned walking dead weaponized technology like in Terminator Salvation except they're not good guys now we're not going to let your species live in this sort of tremendous human suffering you'll leave us no choice if you will not shore up your operations but to mercy kill your species so the rest of us living species can survive with you all having lost it like a swarming plague as well festering cannibalizing yourselves and everything you have and need to survive with the rest of us need to survive with and barely even have because you all have so much you will not share they have mastered this technology we have here this enemy of yours of ours you're facing a full automation system every product every mill in this country is capable of producing in a state of having been weaponized to an automated weapons system with its 
most dangerous munition being a human element as the master operators of these systems. There are no way humans. You cannot treat human, cannot assume to be human, have no human rights. You will not survive giving any sort of human chance. You have never shown humanity in any way, species. The way it seems like these weapons are being shown humanity. You're being humane to them. Like it's just the products and the uniforms. And our terms are, you are all just this some sort of mill species. You're all just products of these mills that produce the products you have to use to survive. The rest of us don't and don't even want in existence. You don't stand a chance if you can't get here to the city-state honoring I, your leader, the father of your nation, above the child node, this government and its governance and its systems are. If you don't get here to fall in for me to train in my system, Completely respecting me, so I will completely respect you. You don't stand a snowball's chance in hell. You don't stand an angel's chance in hell. You have no idea how far this rabbit hole, this automation weapons system goes. Because you have not shown I any humanity. You will not show up to address I so I can address you so we can even confirm you still exist since the start of this pandemic. The system you're facing has been built around the torture of I. They've done everything to me they're now doing to you. They've done it all to me alone. I've survived. I've thrived, I've won, I've adapted, I've evolved, I've created systems to handle this. You don't stand a chance if you don't at least start with where I'm at. Leverage everything I have. You will not solve this problem without my complete system of solutions to start with. You don't stand a chance. You're already gone. There's not a chance on God's green earth at this point that any of you will even try to honor your lives by getting here, respecting me, so I can train you directly to survive. Every type of destructive male technology has been weaponized, automated, and is mobile, mobilizing, has mobilization, is mobilized against you. This is the epicenter. They're staging here. They have endless resources to send at you from here. If you're not prepared to survive the most terrifying, difficult death conditions of everything all males can put you in all at once at one mill, you won't survive. The system is the system of every possible death condition every mill with death conditions all at once 
and mobile units that will mobilize on you, that are staging here, that have endless resources, that will endlessly attack you in never-ending sequences, as I am under here. They're moving on you. They're working their intelligence. I'm trying to control them. Save the farms. I'm being attacked by one right now. Can you hear it? Can you see in there? You see the changes in me? You hear my pain? You hear my voice change? You won't stand a chance. You don't get here to prepare some form. It's a species you're supposed to be, supposed to be collective species capable of surviving and adapting to change, learning. I'm trying to route them as a have mobilized and are going for mobilization to the major corridors, I-80, 8090, the main, the main rail routes across the nation, split the nation. They're talking about taking New York and Pittsburgh so that from there they can take Detroit, Chicago. I don't know their sequences. They were talking about having them take Green Bay. And in no appropriate order, Iowa City, Iowa, Kansas City, Kansas, Kansas City, Missouri, Tallahassee, Florida, the Superdome in Louisiana. I forget the I forget the, the, the city and the state. Phoenix, Arizona, Las Vegas, Nevada, Seattle. Portland, San Francisco, L.A., Detroit, Salt Lake City, Texas City, Texas. You don't stand a chance if you don't respond within about 48 hours. Fall into formation for I. So I respect, bring I the resources, I to survive. So I can train you to survive this before this situation times out and you lose total control any way, shape, or form, any theory left. You in any way, shape, or form have any control at all. with the Sarmat Satan's, the Sarmat Systems, Satan 2 missiles to be deployed in under months at this point. And with you totally failing, and just imploding on each other with no particular end in sight. There is no choice but to destroy you all while destroying all of this technology. Creating a situation where this can never happen again. In the name of your children, the name of your wives, the name of your brothers and sisters, the name of your mothers and fathers, the name of your aunts and uncles, the name of your cousins, the name of your grandparents, the name of the Son, the Father, the Holy Spirit. Make your top priority getting here 
to respect I, providing I with the wealth I need so I can survive, to train you to survive, to return to your communities so you can return to what it takes so you and they can survive. God help us. So be it. God help me. God help you. God help us all.